Howdy, I'm Matt, and in this episode, we're going to be looking at the Real ACC or Real Accessories LiPo Safe Storage Bag. So, with that said, let's go and get it open. Now, before we go any further, I just want to go on the record and say that any LiPo storage bag like this is always a good idea for us as RC pilots. Now, there are three reasons why you would be using and you should be using LiPo safe bags like this. The first one is for charging your LiPo batteries. So when you have a LiPo battery which is on charge, so if we get this one up and open, so maybe we'll use this larger 8000s on there. When we've got this battery on charge, we keep that battery in here, so God forbid if it was to get catch on fire or to fail for example, then it will keep it restrained for a short period of time so that you're able to deal with it. In other words, grab it and throw it out the door. I've just hit the camera. Uh, but you, you know the point is that the point of these bags are to save, the point of these bags are to give you time while that battery is doing whatever bad thing it's doing. Okay, so in other words, you're gonna grab it by the handle and you're gonna lob it out the door. Now, the other two reasons for a LiPo safe bag is the storage of LiPo batteries so that you're able to keep your batteries stored in here so that they're A, that they're protected and B, God forbid, like I said, if one of them was to go, then you've got them all contained in one area and this will buy you a minute or two while these things are going off, okay? Uh, and the other reason is for transportation so that when it's a flying day, you're able to put all your batteries or collection of batteries uh, into one container and then keep them protected because do keep in the back of your mind is that lipo batteries are genuinely normally only ever protected by a very thin film of plastic uh, and when they go they really do go there's not much protection to them and it only takes a pinprick to set them off so looking at this lipo bag specifically it is approximately at what, what should we say five 10, 15 centimeters uh, wide by 5, 10, 22 centimeters uh, wide or length long and then depth, if we pull that up, that's approximately, we'll say nine centimeters or 10 centimeters deep. So you are gonna be able to fit a whole variety of batteries. Uh, I'm not even gonna bother putting the little ones in there because it's really obvious. Uh, they're about the length of a 2200 4S or 2203S. You would be easily able to get in several 5200 multi-star packs in there or 4S packs in there, I think one, two, three, uh, what we'll say six, maybe more of those packs in there and of course larger lipos like this 8000 for us would easily fit into a lipo storage bag like this so let me just quickly reiterate there are three main reasons why you would want a lipo safe bag like this the first one is for charging your batteries so leave your leaves hanging out never put the charger inside there as well that's not the best idea because uh, it's got fans and these create heat number two for the storage of, of your batteries when they're at home uh, and of course remember we keep these lipos out of the way of kids um, although some of us might be big kids uh, I might edit that out. I think I might leave it in you know where I'm going on that one uh, and of course uh, for the transportation of batteries as well so it's a flying day we're gonna load it up with batteries do it up stick it in the flight bag and then when we get there Ta-da, we've got all our batteries, and it's just that extra layer of protection. Uh, taking a quick look at the bag itself, the stitching is good all around. It is of a fair size as well. You are gonna get a real collection of batteries in here. Again, that's a 5200 4S. Uh, you will fit several of those in there for sure zip it up and happy days. Now, in all seriousness, I know some of you may have heard this story before because I've done a couple of reviews on LiPo bags very recently. In all seriousness, LiPo bags like these are a exceptionally good idea for us as RC pilots because a friend of mine, a fellow pilot, uh, before the standardization of balance leads, he bought an adapter uh, and unfortunately he went home and charged his LiPo battery and it caught fire. It burnt down his garage and literally within the state it could have been just a couple of minutes more and his house and his neighbor's house could have gone. So in all seriousness, it doesn't matter if you choose this LiPo safe bag or a different one, then a 
genuinely speaking, they are an absolutely fantastic idea and I strongly urge you to use them for those three reasons, the charging, the storage and the transportation of LiPo batteries because remember, there is only a very thin piece of plastic which is protecting these batteries and it only takes a pinprick to set these off and of course once one cell goes, chances are the other cells are going to go and LiPo safe bags like these are going to buy you some time. Now, with all the seriousness out of the way, I want to say a big thank you to Banggood for supporting us with this episode and sending this back here so that we can review it. What it does actually say on the description of some of these LiPo bags is that they are explosion proof. So look out for a later episode where we stick fireworks, petrol and use a blowtorch on these uh, and of course stab a LiPo battery as well to see how well they contain a LiPo once it's gone off or even worst case you've stuffed it full of fire fireworks and kind of set fire to them all. So with that said, for myself, Matt, a big thank you to you for taking the time to join me here at the workbench. I try not to giggle because it's going to be absolutely mental. Uh, and on that note, for myself, Matt, cheerios! <laughs>